Good morning everybody and welcome back to another vlog. So today I thought I would, let me get out of the sun. There. <laughs> so today I thought I would take you guys along for a day in my life here as a Canadian living abroad in Germany, doing a physiotherapy Ausbildung or um, apprenticeship in English. Um, and I'm in my practicum, my very first practicum of the program and I'm at a school for disabled children and it's been, it's been a lot of fun. You know, the first week was very exhausting. The second week was a bit better. I'm on my third week now. So I think I'm, I'm getting the hang of the ropes and it should be good. So I just thought I would take you guys along. Uh, this morning I had to wake up at six. It's now almost 6.30. And at 6.45, I usually try and leave the flat to walk down to catch my bus because I need to be at the school at 7.30. And unfortunately, the only bus that gets there before 7.30 is pretty early. It gets there at like 10 after seven. So I'm gonna take my breakfast because um, I have some time there to spare and uh, I gotta finish getting ready now so we can go. Welcome to a new vlog. Good afternoon so I'm back from my practicum for the day and I always just need to take a breather when I get home because being on public transit being in a school surrounded by children all day it's it's a lot and it's kind of different from what I'm used to so usually when I get home I just need to take a breather so I'm making myself for lunch because the day is over pretty early it's because I'm in a school the day for me is over pretty early so I'm having my lunch now I just made some pasta to go with some tomato sauce from like a few days ago so I'm just gonna have uh, revitalized leftovers for lunch and and then I'm just gonna chill for like half an hour, an hour, hang out, not do anything, not just, just like sit in quiet for a bit. Just relax. All right, so I've taken a nice break. I was doing some knitting. I was watching the first episode of the new Witcher season and very good. I've been looking forward to that for a long time so it was great i just finished knitting this tank top actually and i'm pretty happy about it i think it's really awesome that one of my hobbies is also kind of functional because you know i get to make things that i'm actually wearing and it's great i love it also the perfect way to wind down after a really loud busy day at the school I also thought I would share a little garden update with you guys. I think I showed in the last vlog some, but oh boy, like every single day, there's just like so much growth in our garden. And just over the last week, it's it's just exploded. We have a few blueberries that are ripe. I still need to pick those. I just picked some peas. We have some roses blooming. Um, we also have a butternut squash that I planted kind of just experimental. I didn't know if it was actually gonna take off or not, but oh boy, it has. It looks like it's doing so well. The leaves are huge, green, and it's just growing so fast. And I'm really, really happy about that.
I would say that the size of our balcony at this flat is the best thing about this apartment. <laughs> Unfortunately, we are looking at some other apartments over the next while and we are really hoping to find another one with a balcony. I, we know that it's not going to be as big as this one. This was pretty spectacular that we got a flat with a balcony this big. So <laughs> we're probably going to have to downsize our garden and it'll be really interesting to see like when, if and when we move, how that's gonna go down with our plants. Especially because like if we're moving this summer or this fall, um, things are still growing, things are still alive. And so it would have been kind of nice if we moved before because things would have still been really small in their pots, but that's just how it works. And we're just going to have to figure out a way to do that if if we end up moving in the next few months. But one nice thing about moving is that it kind of forces you to do a lot of those little jobs that you've been putting off and procrastinating. So because it's on the horizon for us, we've been doing some decluttering and just like taking into account the things that we have, things that we use, things that we don't use. We've been selling some things, giving some things away that we just don't use, especially kitchen things. Like we were gifted this popcorn machine um, and we never use it because it's like so tiny and it only makes like a little tiny portion of popcorn. And now we're just making popcorn like in a pot on the stove. So it's little things like that, which we probably won't have room to store in our next place. So we're just trying to give it away to somebody who's actually going to use it. Little things like that. When added together, make a big difference. So we are going to be headed out. We're going to go rock climbing. One of our favorite hobbies of late has been rock climbing. We've been going like two, three times a week and it's great. I love it. We have gotten a lot better in the last month and it's just so, so much fun and so rewarding. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go rock climbing this evening and come on with us. So we're back from climbing. It was a very successful time. Um, I did some that were pretty difficult, <laughs> that looked really cool, but you know, I didn't finish them. That's okay. I think what's really important is just to like really try the more difficult ones. And one thing that's kind of fun is our climbing gym right now is having a bit of a competition, but they're not ranking the climbs that are in the competition they're just like random numbered and that's kind of fun because you kind of go into them without any expectations about what the rating is and then you're trying some that maybe you wouldn't have tried before so yeah it was a lot of fun climbing and now i've washed my hair i'm really hoping that it dries at least a little bit before i go to sleep because i was hoping to go to bed early tonight i'm so tired but my hair takes so long to dry so we'll see but nonetheless thank you for spending the day with me i hope you like this video if you're interested in this video 
or other topics related to living abroad, studying German, doing an Ausbildung, physiotherapy, just life itself, having a good time, then definitely consider subscribing to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.